This is 1964 Roosevelt Dime from Special Mint Set. Otherwise known as SMS Dime. Graded as SP66 by PCGS. According to Heritage Auctions, a razor-sharp satin finish premium gem example of the 1964 SMS Dime. Special Mint Sets were issued in place of proof sets from 1965 to 1967. However, in the 1990s, a number of five-coin sets from 1964 surfaced with similar finishes. All coins from these sets are rare. This premium gem SMS dime displays razor-sharp detail and a dusting of champagne lavender toning with no surface abrasions. I appeal is outstanding. It was sold for $10,200. Number 4. This is 1964 Lincoln sent from Special Mint Set. The circumstances surrounding the production of these 1964 Special Mint Set scents is shrouded in mystery. It is believed they were possibly produced as prototypes for the SMS coins that were eventually struck in 1965 through 1967. David Longy has speculated, these pieces were probably coined at the Philadelphia Mint in the summer or fall of 1965, at which time the 1964 date was still in use by authority of the Act of September 3, 1964. He also allows for the possibility that they were struck at the San Francisco Mint. We know that the 20 to 50 coins extant, no one really knows how many were made, were acquired by Lester Merkin from the estate of former Mint director Eva Adams and first offered publicly in 1993. Even today, auction appearances for the 1964 SMS Center are rare. Number 3. 1964 Jefferson Nickel from Special Mint Set. Graded as SP68 with full steps by PCGS. A phenomenal absolute and condition rarity worthy of inclusion in the finest Jefferson Nickel set. Satiny surfaces are silky smooth in texture and lightly toned in gorgeous champagne gold. Fully struck, and simply a delight to behold. Exactly how many prototype 1964 SMS Jefferson Nickels were produced is not known with certainty as no records were kept regarding this coinage. This rare specimen was sold for $31,200. Number 2. This is attractively toned 1964 D. Washington Quarter. Graded as MS-68 by PCGS. And proven by CAC. According to Stax Bowers, vivid multicolored toning has a slightly mottled distribution over both sides of this frosty and essentially pristine example. Shades of orange copper, salmon pink, sea green and antique gold are all in evidence very attractive. At 704,135,528 coins struck, the 1964D has the highest mintage in the Washington Quarter series up to that point in time. It was sold for $38,400. Number 1. And this is 1964 Kennedy Half Dollar from Special Mint Set. Graded as SP67 by PCGS. Certified by PCGS as a 1964 SMS Kennedy Half Dollar, this coin represents the rarest issue by far in the series. There has been much debate regarding whether or not these coins were originally issued in special sets, since they were never in any form of special mint packaging, and official special mint sets were not issued until 1965. Sets of 1964 coins, including special strikes of the cent through half dollar, first began appearing in stack sales in the early 1990s. The 1964 SMS Kennedy half dollar is struck on a 90% silver planchet, from a single pair of dies, showing much sharper detail than the regular issue and having a satiny surface texture. Die markers include, on the obverse, a tiny apostrophe-shaped lump of extra metal protruding from the bottom edge of the crosslet of the four in the date. This utmost rarity ended up selling for $108,000. So this wraps up today's episode. Like, share, comment and subscribe. God's will, see you in the next video. Take care.